much for clicking this video it's me again teacher Ada Jules of 5 One talk and for today's video as you can see on the title it's about the questions that you will be asked during the interview okay so if you are interested to be part of 5 One talk here are the questions you need to prepare for before you have your phone interview okay so let's go by the way <laughs> I just want to show you my shirt and I've already shown this to you in another vlog and yes I just like it because it really feels comfortable when you wear it and that's it okay <laughs> so let's get it on to the video all right so guys this is what will happen during the interview you sign up and then you're going to expect a call after 24 to 48 hours and then after that they're going to call you and they're going to ask for 10 to 15 minutes if you're available for an interview and yes of course you are because you're waiting for their call and here are the questions that you're going to prepare for before you start your interview so i want to make this video so you can have um, an idea about the questions that will be asked during the interview of course you already know because these are just common just i just want you to prepare okay so the first question that the interviewer will ask you is your ting, birthday they are going to ask you about your birthday okay basically you're going to tell them your personal information and birthday is included after your name and age okay so that is that is really important your birthday okay so next is where do you live your location that's also going to be asked okay and then after that they'll either ask you if this is your first application in 5-1 talk Okay, so if it's yes or no, it depends on you guys. Because basically, these questions are mm, personal, so I cannot answer it for you. There, there are no wrong answers in these questions, so don't you worry. Wag ka lang kabahan, and do not let panic get you, because sis... Walang matutulong yung panic talaga. I've been there. Relax ka lang. Um, sound confident but not too confident. Okay. So next one is... Why did you decide to apply here as a teacher? Hmm. Bakit? 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 The answer depends on you. Bakit nga ba? You have to ask yourself also. So ask yourself first before you sign up on that link. All right, so next one is, what is your ISP or internet service provider? You're not going to proceed with your application process if there are lacking equipments. Okay, so if ayaw mo pang mag-invest, you can either ask a friend from 5-1 Talk or maybe yung nag-refer sa'yo if you can have your training and your technical check at home. Sa bahay nila. Kung wala ka pa. Okay. Kasi, alam mo naman, risky talaga. So, if wala talaga, pwede mo yung gawin. But, before you get launched, make sure na meron ka na talagang internet connection sa bahay. At, of course, laptop or PC. Since we're talking about ISP or internet service provider, how fast is it? So this is the speed of your internet connection. You can either say 3, 5, 10, 15, or 20, or higher than that. You have your own PC or laptop. Of course, you have to have your own. But if you're too scared to invest and hindi mo, tal hindi mo sure sa sarili mo kung makukuha ka ba, well, I think you need to just say yes even if makikiram ka lang naman. Okay, so... May magagamit ka ba for the tech check? Yes. But of course, mas mas okay pa rin talaga kung kung own equipment mo yung gagamitin mo. Kasi 
malalaman mo kung pass ba or fail yung laptop na gagamitin mo. Meron ako mga referral din na doon pa lang sila kumuha sa home credit ng laptop right after na launch na sila. So, depende na kasi talaga yan sa discard mo. Okay? And, ting! And, do you have a headset with noise cancelling feature? So, para sa mga baguhan pa lang, sa mga newbie or hindi pa talaga, hindi pa, hindi pa talaga ganap na 5-1 talk teacher, I can recommend you the Logitech H151 or yung mga kahit anong Logitech na may noise cancelling feature. Hindi guaranteed na makakancel niya talaga ang noise, lalo na pag may batong umiiyak, may nag-YouTube, may aso, hindi talaga siya guaranteed. Pero, if yung electric fan lang siguro or yung mga liit na noise kaya niya pero yung mga grabe na talaga hindi wag kayong mag-expect pero for the meantime lang naman yan muna kasi alam ko hindi niyo pa kaya talaga mag-invest sa mas mamahaling headset next do you have an HD camera okay so if HD naman talaga ang camera sa laptop niyo you really don't need to buy an external camera if hindi talaga siya HD, kailangan yung yung tip kasi dyan sa tech check is ilalagay nyo yung light sa likod ng camera dito at dito. Make sure na walang shadow kasi yun ang pinaka-importante. Do you have a LAN cable? Yung LAN cable is yun yung yellow na kasama sa internet connection nyo. Yung kinoconnect from the modem to your laptop. Kasi mas fast and reliable yung internet pag connected siya. Do you have a clutter-free environment? Ito yung environment mo. Clutter-free means walang kalat, walang, walang, luma, na, walang naglalakad sa likod mo, walang nagsasalita, walang maingay, wala. So, good for teaching ba? It depends on you. Do you have a well-lit space? So, dapat maganda yung lighting ng, ano mo, ng lugar mo. Yung kung saan ka planong magturo. Kasi, hindi pwedeng may mga shadow. Yung reason kasi nila is yung ibang students, um, meron ibang students na takot sa shadow, or ayaw makinig kasi poor quality yung camera mo. Yung mga ganun na factors. So, iwasan na lang natin yun. Do you have a Skype account? So, kailangan natin ng Skype kasi dyan tayo iko-contact ng mga facilitators, mga trainers na mag-handle sa atin throughout the application process. So, if wala kong Skype, sis, anong gagawin? Gumawa ng Skype! Alright. So, mag adjust adjust tayo, sis. Okay? Yes, you do. You will give them your Skype ID. What's your Skype ID? Highest educational attainment. Just to be sure, college graduate ka. Kasi 5 on talk is abiding the policy of the Chinese government. Hindi na sila tumatanggap ng undergrad. Pede pero may experience. Mga 2 years sa college, with 2 years siguro din na BPO experience. Or teacher din sa other ESL companies. So, it depends, pero mas okay talaga if four-year course ang nag-graduatean mo. If you have experience, ano yun? So, dito ka na magpapasikat, sis. Pasikat mo na yung mga alam mo sa buhay. Yung mga experience mo, yung mga kaya mo gawin. So, yan, pasikat ka na dito na. Now is the time. Of course, sasabihin sig siguro, sasabihin mo, meron kang experience ngayon ito, ngayon ito. Hahanapan ka ng college credentials. So, Kailangan meron kang diploma, kailangan meron kang certifications na nagpapatunay na graduate ka talaga. Next, NBI clearance. NBI clearance. Kailangan mong magkaroon ng NBI clearance. Hindi pwedeng wala. Kailangan yun. How do you feel about teaching kids? Kasi alam niyo naman sa 5-1 Talk, most of the students are kids. How do you feel about teaching kids? Kayo ba ay nagagalak, nalulungkot, nahihiya? Ano na feel nyo? Depende na yun sa personal yung sagot at dun magbabase yung interviewer if pasok ka ba talaga. 
kung kaya mo. Okay? Of course, sis, you want this job, so you will say, I feel happy. I like kids. <laughs> okay. okay. So if you do like kids, what are your strategies to make the lesson fun and engaging? Tiktok, tiktok, tiktok. Magisip ka na. Anong isasagot mo? <laughs> if the student is not paying attention, how will you deal with it? Paano kaya? Paano kaya? So, sis, mag-isip ka na ng iba-ibang mga, ano mo dyan, mga pwedeng gawin. Kasi that will help during the interview. Ba't nagpapabebe? <laughs> Example, you will say, I will call their attention. How will you call their attention? Basically, these following questions are about how you handle kids. Dito ka na i-assess kung pwede ka ba talaga maging teacher. These questions may or may not be asked by the interviewer. Maybe it will be another question, another um, another set of questions. Pero depende na talaga yan sa'yo. So, mas, mas okay talaga na mag-prepare ka. Nursery rhyme song. You need to prepare, sis. You need to prepare one or two nursery rhyme songs na kakantahin mo sa interviewer. Yes, kakanta ka. It's okay, hindi mo kailangan may boses na katulad ni Moira. Okay lang yan. Kahit, kahit anong kantahin mo, okay lang. Alam mo anong importante dito? Yung pronunciation mo. Tsaka diction mo. Yun yung kailangan nila talagang i-assess. Yun yung pinofocus nila. Pinapakanta ka nila, pero hindi, hindi nila ina-assess kung maganda ba ang boses mo, nahihit mo ba ang mga notes. Hindi. Ina-assess nila kung okay ka ba talagang mag... Okay ba talaga yung pronunciation mo? Pasok ba bilang teacher? Is it twinkle, twinkle, little star? How I wonder what you are. Siguro ano, hindi ganun, no? <laughs> okay, so, kailangan mo mag-prepare. Kahit mas okay yung hindi common. Like, ano na lang siguro? A, B, C, D... <laughs> <laughs> hindi common. Kahit ano, depende na sa'yo. May bibigay pa pala akong tips sa inyo. Ito yung mga songs na pwede niyong kantahin. Ano lang to ha, tips? Pwede niyo kayong kumanta ng wala dito, okay? ABC song, um, Twinkle Twinkle, Jack and Jill, uh, Row, Row, Row Your Boat, Baby Shark, Baby Shark, do, 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 do. walang masyadong lyrics. <laughs> so, wag na lang yung Baby Shark. Ano, um... Two little black birds, or there was a farmer had a dog, and Bingo was his name. Oh, Bingo song, or hmm, ano pa ba? Pat a cake, pat a cake, baker's man. Basta kahit anong songs na alam nyo, one or two songs lang naman. If hindi sila, actually one lang siguro, kasi if hindi sila satisfied sa first song. Example, yung kinanta mo is Baby Shark. So, walang masyadong lyrics yun. Hindi mahalata yung pronunciation mo. Maybe they're going to request for another song. So, yung something naman na merong lyrics talaga. Like, Twinkle, Twinkle. Yung Row, Row, Row Your Boat. Yung mga ganon, sis. Alam mo na yun. Okay. So, yun na yun. That's it for this video. I hope I helped you somehow. I hope you passed that interview. I stand for you, sis. I stand for you. Sana mapasan nyo yun and prepare for it. Sound confident but not too confident. Alam nyo na yan. And I wish you the best of luck and welcome to 51 Talk. I can assist you if you want to. You can click my referral link below and you can ask me anything. Okay, as long as naka, as long as naka sign up ka under my name, I'm gonna help you all throughout. But I cannot help you with the equipment. Sorry. I can only give you tips and mga strategies. Yes, I have a lot of those. However, for the equipment, sorry, I cannot extend my help because um, very complicated na situation natin ngayon. Pero I'm going to, I'll do my best to help you. Click yun lang yung link below if you want to be a teacher and let's talk. You can also send me a direct message on Facebook if you want to. Just don't send me a message on Gmail because I don't open my Gmail account anymore. If you want a fast reply, you can send me a message here. Okay? But please naman, be respectful naman din. Hi! Yung mga greetings naman na ano. Huwag nyo naman akong i-oy.
Uy, pwede mong hingi ng tips sa'yo. Like, sis, I give tips. Hindi talaga ako nag-i-ignore ng messages. Pero, huwag naman ganyan, sis. Pero kahit ganun yung message niya, alam niya, nireplyan ko pa rin. <laughs> pero, parang nawala na talaga ako na gano'ng mag-reply. Kasi, inuoy niya talaga. Meron naman ako name sa Facebook. Bakit inuoy? <laughs> But it's okay, bye bye tayo. Maybe ganun na talaga siya. Anyway, thank you very much for clicking this video. And I'm very, very happy to see you soon on 5-1 Talk. And para naman talaga magkikita. Joke lang yun. That's it for this video, guys. And I hope it was somehow useful for you. Sana naka-take down notes. Naka-notes. Sana naka-take down kaya lang notes while listen to, listening to me. Don't forget to follow me on my social media accounts. I have Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok. Yes! Woo -hoo -hoo. TikTok. Alright, thank you very much. And let's see each other again on my next video. Bye!